welcome. I am Joshua. This is my sister Amber. I'm going to be reviewing the Wings of Fire Dragon Up Prophecy graphic novel, and I really do like the Wings of Fire series. This has gorgeous pictures. I can't tell if you can see it or not, but it has very gorgeous pictures. It is beautiful. Amber, you can leave now. I love this book. Um, it does a great interpretation of the book. It's basically a quick summary with pictures. And who doesn't love pictures? So, um, I do like this quite a bit. And that's a cool picture right there of uh, the Sky Palace. Um, I'm going to be doing more Wings of Fire reviews, book reviews. Um, mostly of this one and a few others too. But I love these books so much. And also, one of my favorite things about this book is they get all of the dragon's portrayals just like how I thought they would look. And I started reading Wings of Fire with this book. Um, if you were watching this video, do not spoil. At this moment, I have not read Brightest Night or the Quibbly's book, Dur Darkness of Dragons. Yes. Never read either of those, and yeah, so, also, this book doesn't have all of the violent parts that if you love Wings of Fire, you know about, like, it doesn't have him burn me on, like, wah, and throwing, um, Kavita off a mountain, that is how you say it right, is it Kavita or Kavita? I haven't read the, I haven't had the audiobook read to me in a while, so, um, yeah, um, so I do love this book quite a bit. It does take a portrayal everything, and it has about as long at the end of the book where they go to meet um Clay's family. Yeah, um, here. So it starts with them walking. I didn't even know that. I thought they swam there the entire time, but um, it has this. And then, look at that gore right there. Like, that's blue Icewing blood. So, that does confirm that Icewing blood is blue. Like, it's in the Darkstalker. Blech. And then you have about as many pages as it took up in the actual book of dragons. And look! I didn't realize the hollows that they lived in looked like that. Neat, right? Um, there's a bunch of stuff, like... It shows a lot of the great imagery, and of course, the Wings of Fire series by Tweety Sutherland, um, and then the, here's the other artist. None of this is mine, though. This is all somebody else's, so give respect to these people, if you can see it. It's pretty blurry. I do want, one of my favorite inclusions is the colored map of Pyria. I love this map. I have studied this map to death. And, basically, it has everything great about the Dragonette Prophecy with pictures. And it's just, it, the color scheme is great. I love the drawing design. I can never draw. I wish I had the pictures I drew a little while ago of a sandwing. Because I am indeed a sandwing. I took a bunch of tests, and it was pretty fun. This doesn't have any spoilers in it. But when I do the actual Wings of Fire Dragonette Prophecy review, it will have spoilers. So this is a non-spoiler. I love this book. Basically, all of these are basically me going to say, I love these books! So it even has, like, Peril and her whole scene of killing dragons, setting them ablaze. That's not a spoiler, is it? Well, whatever. <laughs> like, it has all of the great imagery and stuff. I really don't know what else to say. Bye!